Alright y'all, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel, man. I haven't said that in a long time. If you are watching this video, seriously, thank you so much. I haven't posted in two to three months, and I really haven't gave you guys an update about my car in two to three months, you know? So I think it's well overdue. I want to be back. I want to start uh, making videos again, even if I don't have my car, because I love doing this, and the only reason I quit is because it became winter. I wasn't going out as much doing car stuff because I don't have a car. And riding passenger just isn't the same. Like, making YouTube videos on pe other people's cars is absolutely not the same. So, that's pretty much what happened with that. You know, that's really why I haven't posted much. You know, my car is still down. But first off, let's talk about my jobs, you know. So, I was jobless for a while. Work, you know, paid bills with my own money that I had saved up to do YouTube full time. That was like August, September, October. And um, I was doing that, and then that's when my car blew up. That's when it all kind of went to shit, honestly. Hate to say it, it, it really went to shit. So um, when my car blew up, I was like, man, I need a job now because I know it's going to cost some money. So I got a job, started working at FedEx, and pretty much with working at FedEx, it started getting the busier season. You know, November, December. I really was working till 6, 7 o'clock some days. By that time, I couldn't really record. I didn't have my car. So, um, yeah, it really sucked. I'm not going to lie. That FedEx, they treated me good, but just was not the job to make videos and post. Now, just this month, starting in January, I did take a new job at Ford selling cars. So, a car salesman, you know? But uh, I'm super excited for this because obviously I make car videos. I do car stuff. This is this is something I feel like I'd be good at, you know? So with that being said, if you ever need a Ford, you need a used car, you need whatever it is, Sutton Ford, Madsen, Illinois, I'll put the link down below and uh, come shop with your boy. I'll hook you up. If you know me, message me. Leave a comment, you know? Tell me you need a little something. Tell me you want a Mustang GT because, by the way, that's the gold, too. I want to know your guys' thoughts. With Ever since working at Ford, I get a little discount now for myself. Should I get a Mustang GT 10-speed? Obviously, I'd keep the Camaro. Definitely going to keep the Camaro. But uh, for times like this, I feel like, uh, I feel like I need a second car. You know, I could have been having content this whole time. And it's not because I didn't want to upload. I wanted to upload. I just didn't know what to upload, you know? So, like I said, should I get it? comment down below comment down below if i should get a mustang gt or maybe look at something else but the reason mustang i get a good discount because i work at ford so and if you need a mustang family car whatever it is hit me up um so now what everybody's been wanting to hear an update on the car so let's start from the beginning if you didn't watch it my car blew up it happened there's nothing i could do you know the shop didn't want to help me out that built it. They were giving me the runaround. So right now it's at next level tuning. They have taken nothing but good care of me, treating me with respect, you know? And the reason it's taken so long is not their fault at all. Parts haven't came in. Like parts literally have been on order for three months, still have yet to come in. So here we are, three months later, my pistons haven't arrived. I got a new crank, I got a new oil pump, I got all this. Pistons haven't arrived. So, a week or two ago, I decided, you know what, if we're going to take three months to build the car, I'd rather you take four or five months to build the car and build it right. The longer it sat, the longer I was like, okay, is NA going to be the end goal? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, 600 horsepower is cool. Yeah, I want to make that nine second pass NA, but what, what happens after that? Do I sell the car? I don't know. So you know what, let's build the motor. We're already in this deep. So we got forged pistons, rods, forged crank, all that uh, to handle 900 to 1,000 horsepower. Now, we're not gonna do this right off the bat. We're not gonna go boost or, yeah, we're not gonna go boost right off the bat. We're gonna go NA this year, like I said. We're still gonna run the same exact setup. Cam, stall, Holly high ram, ported heads, all that stuff, uh, higher compression. We are gonna do that. We're gonna get that nine second pass this year. We're gonna get it. That's, that is the goal. I'm gonna do whatever I have to do. Completely NA, get that nine second pass. 
and then the goal for next year is to boost it so make 900 a thousand horsepower i think that's like a that's the perfect spot to be in you know you got to keep growing especially with youtube and stuff got to be faster quicker so i want to hang with the big boys eventually but um so yeah that's where it's at now the parts i was told this week that the parts should be here this week. And he said he's gonna start on my motor right away. So that's some really good news. I'm I'm crossing my fingers because it's been so damn long that I don't even, I feel like I don't own the car. I feel like I got the car repoed, like seriously. I went to go look at it, you know, a few weeks ago, but I, I just, it doesn't feel like I have that car no more. I drive around my daily all day. Um, so I'm really excited to get that back. Yeah, so now that, now that you guys got an update on the car, Sorry for this long, drawn-out video, but, you know, I really wanted to update you guys. So, now that you got an update on the car, let's go to the next step. Texas 2K, baby. Let's go. We're going to make it to Texas 2K. That's the goal. That's what I told uh, Next Level. Have the car done by Texas 2K. I know if the parts aren't in, the parts aren't in. But if I have to go buy stock parts and, like, and go f to another state or something and buy used stock parts just to get there, I'll get there. I don't care. I want to be at Texas 2K, and I want to see you guys all at Texas 2K. So if you're going to Texas 2K, hit me up. Let's meet up. Let's gab some fools. Let's let's get down, you know. Uh, it's it's pretty much the place where everybody goes in March to street race, you know. That's, that's the vibe we're going. We went last year. Uh, I was a smaller YouTuber. I didn't do much. I didn't record as much because I was uh, a little out of my element. But this year's a little different. I'm feeling good. You know, I've done a lot more YouTube, a lot more of that. So I'm pretty excited for this year, you know. So if you are going to go, hit me up. Let's meet up. Let's get some races in. Let's uh, let's chill, you know. I want to meet everybody. You know, I want to meet Fast Life, Fast Life Russ. Uh, on 3, I want to meet all those guys. So it should be a super good time. I'm going to pretty much end this video here because I talked. It. I just talked the whole time. And uh, I'm pretty much back. I'm going to put out another video that I, I recorded, you know, a few weeks ago of a little Chicago takeover. So that was cool. It was really cold. So I just kind of, I it was literally like negative 10 degrees. So I just cut the video. Um, never uploaded it. So yeah, like I said, if you go to Texas 2K, comment down below. If I should get a Mustang GT, comment down below. And uh, if you're happy I'm back, say what's up. Thank you guys all for the support, man. We've been growing 3,000 plus subscribers. That's nuts. Absolutely crazy. Thank you, each and every one of you. I appreciate you guys. Have a good one. right here yes sir yes sir I can do it better what's good what's good how you feeling how you feeling hey, hey, hey I had to come out at least once Oh, my God.